Hi friends, here we have a very huge 4500 kilowatt motor, 4.5 megawatt motor, industrial motor. This is a slip ring type of motor. I am going to show you uh, further details for this motor. Here you can see the name plate is inside, way too far from here. I cannot go in. So here you can see the power is written uh, by a marker or paint. 4500 kilowatt these are the cables six cables are coming out of winding just going to show you inside and these are the strip windings inside for the stator in the rotor circuit also there are windings so this is wound rotor motor for industry here you can see uh, this is rotor and inside is stator here this, this way you can see and here is the cooling disc and uh, this one is the bearing the bearing is of course oil lubricated oil bar type oil flow is there there are uh, there is a unit outside um, which is providing oil oil pressure to the bearings this is plain journal type bearing and here is the temperature sensor for the uh, bearing or oil and uh, then you can see here are the carbon brushes hanging uh, this is slip ring type of motor so slip rings are there three slip rings you can see and multi brushes multi carbon brushes you can see the carbon brush type is of course ch 17 chinese brush so multi brushes have been installed the reason for the multi brushes is the current density of course uh, much more current density we can achieve if we install more brushes uh, these Parts they are known as rockers where the brushes are installed uh, and these are the brush holder where the brush is installed in something like this and then there is a spring spring you can see like this and the spring we are going to install on the brush and it is providing stress or spring tension over the brush and all the time this the brush is under the spring tension uh, so this way it's connected and the brush is of course consumable parts after a certain time the brush is worn out and it is becoming smaller and smaller up to this this length we can use it and then we are going to replace by this bolt we are going to remove it and then fix another new brush this is a replaceable part uh, so this is and here these uh, cables you can see these are from the rotor we will install them over here this is for the inspection actually we opened this motor and here are the terminal uh, cables for the terminal connections just we are going to bring them off uh, this was and uh, if you like this video uh, give a big thumbs up uh, subscribe on my channel press on the bell icon so you will get notifications thank you for watching